What up everybody? Uh, this is Gare from Homie House and today I'm going to be going to Full Bloom 2024 in Bloomington, Indiana. I live in Fort Wayne so it's like a three hour drive. Gonna be getting a carpool of people down there. We got a room down there. Hopefully gonna hit up the pre-local and yeah let's get this shit going. First thing I'm gonna have to do today is finish the laundry and clean the cat box for my family. My wife is very pregnant right now, so I'm trying to get as much done before I leave for the weekend. Yeah, best of luck to me. All showered, ready, got all my stuff packed. Now I just gotta wait to go pick up the homies and then we will roll. Mid fucking drive, we taking a pit stop. We got one homie, and the others are in the Starbucks. We're about like an hour ish to the venue. I did it. I drove here safely. Oh uh, yeah. Fucking found this dude over here. Found this homie. We got our room. We're here. We're about to play video games. Hello, oh, we hey. at the fucking pre-local boys. Y'all ready fucking know. Got the homies. It's gonna be a good one. Just got back to the hotel room, you know, we had to drink a little. <laughs> and uh, I went two and two at the pre local. I ain't mad. I ain't mad. A little good warm up for tomorrow. You know, I haven't played in a minute. Looking good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> had to play uh, Prince Abu, the guy I drove here. Sleep Round two. Way. Yeah, yeah. What's up with that? TOs. <laughs> Day two, freshly showered. Got my sleeping buddy, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like it's starting to snow here in Bloomington. Hopefully, uh, won't be a problem for the drive home tomorrow. But yeah, today's tournament day. It's 9 a.m. right now. Gonna be doing a lot of melee today. <laughs> Alright, we just got done playing dubs. Dubs. We went one and two. We lost to our fellow homie, Nidus, and his friend, Marth. It happens. It was a good match. No, we did pretty good for not practicing at all. It was a good time. I got some pretty insane handoffs on this cheek. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, right off the bat. Yeah. And overall, I feel like we did pretty well. For sure. It Definitely is. not our worst doubles performance. No, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah. Things felt like we had a lot more patience. Yeah. Trying to string things together. Yeah. But we'll take it. Live and learn. Turn those L's into lessons. Am I right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Full bloom, baby. 
but I'm here to talk about day two. All right, so me and Dave, we played doubles. We played Falcon Ices. We lost our first set. It wasn't too bad though. And then we won our second set, but then we lost our third set to Nidus and his friend. So whatever, I guess. And then uh, I watched Dave play pools at four. He went 0-2. And then I played pools at six. And I went 0-2. Uh, I played two Jigglypuff players. It's a pretty hard matchup for Ice Climbers. But, you know, I'm just here for a good time anyways. I wasn't expecting to do very well, you know. But Rodney, HPR, number one in Fort Wayne, he is in top 64 of loser side and then prince abu who recently moved to fort wayne uh he is in winner side of top 64 and he's got to play mango today so yeah that's the update getting ready to go down to the venue and check out of the hotel and all that stuff dave left early so here by my lonesome prince abu's already in the whatever it's called the venue practicing warming up so i'll be down there soon hopefully get a good seat see lots of homies we'll see what's up one last thing i had to say about all of that is i had to play three jigglypuffs this weekend in the two brackets that i was in lost the three puffs bro so i think bloomington tos hate me right it's the next day uh we ended up leaving right before most of top eight so it was like eight o'clock or something when we got back last night it was a pretty easy drive from bloomington to fort wayne uh it was a good time abu got 13th in singles and then rodney got 65th or 49th one of the i think it's 49th the way uh how that works and then he also did fairly well like 13th in p.m. so that's that's pretty cool pretty happy for all of them it was a really good time you know i don't normally hang out with these guys so it was really fun to get to know them you know they i've known them for a while but i feel like you know i know them a little better now it was a good time and you know didn't bother him too much i had i was hanging out with dave a lot and yeah that's mainly what i wanted to do anyways i was gonna go anyways just to hang out with dave so yeah <laughs> thank you everybody that watched this shout out to everybody that i saw there it was awesome to see a lot of you i know a lot of people came up to me but i'm gonna save uh i'm gonna save the shout outs for the next episode of the homie house podcast um yeah um going forward I'm probably going to be taking a all melee break. The Homie House podcast is going to come to a stop for a little bit. I think we still got like a month's worth of plans left. But after that, I'm probably going to be taking two, three months at least off. Probably longer, but we'll see, you know. Shout out once again, everybody that watches any of my videos. It's been real as fuck. And yeah, I hope everybody enjoys what is left to come. Peace.